Apple makes so much money that any other company is in comparison looks insignificant. In just one quarter, Apple made more money than Amazon has since its inceptions. The company has become a money-making machine with over $200 billion in the bank accounts. In fact, it makes more money than Microsoft, Facebook and Alphabet combined. That's why investors love Apple unlike other tech giants that promise huge profits in the future. Apple is making huge profits now. However, the person who found an Apple and led it to generate never became the world's richest man, unlike some others. In fact, even if if he would be alive today, he still wouldn't be even in the top 10 richest people, even though he has built the world's most valuable company from the scratch. So let's try to find out why Steve Jobs' wealth had nothing to do with the Apple, even though he spent his entire life building it. You see, Steve Jobs uh, had a complicated uh, relationship with Apple. Just after two years of starting Apple, Jobs' uh, net worth uh, was already over a million dollars. In fact, Apple uh, too was so successful uh, that uh, by the time Steve was 25, his net worth uh, exceeded 250 million dollars. That's made him over the youngest people uh, all ever on the Forbes list uh, if uh, the richest people in the United States. Uh, what's more, he was a part of the very tiny group of the people under 30 to uh, make the, the list uh, with no international money. Uh, even when the company combined uh, its uh, initial rounds and uh, found resting, Jobs still held 26% of the company, which put worth today over $214 billion. Uh, none of the none of the less uh, along the way, Jobs keep uh, seeing uh, his uh, uh, shares, uh, and after five years of the company going public, Jobs' uh, shake off the company has dropped only 11%. However, this incredible success didn't last long. After the recruiting uh, John uh, Scully, uh, he held of Pepsi Cola to be its uh, new chief um, executive CEO. Things went bad for Jobs. Uh, these two men had absolutely different visions of the company, and uh, in the spring of uh, 1985, the board uh, sided with uh, John uh, Scully uh, and uh, removed the jobs uh, from his uh, positions. He left the company and uh, sold all of his shares for $130 million. He did retire a single share uh, to that uh, he could receive to the company's annual report. It's uh, at that time uh, when Jobs made most of his fortune. For uh, Steve uh, went uh, to find another computer uh, company that uh, he named uh, Na uh, NEXT. It's mostly focused on the building the computers of the companies, uh, scientists uh, and academics uh, propose, and it had achieved uh, relatively good success, especially with software. Uh, simultaneously, uh, Steve founded Pixar, the animations company that created uh, some of the most popular animated films in the world, uh, such as uh, Toy Story, uh, Finding Nemo, Cars, uh, uh, Bugs, Life, and many more, uh, what uh, were extremely successful. By 2004, the Pixar's contract uh, with Disney was uh, running out. Jobs announced that Pixar would seek a new partner to distribute its films. However, Pixar was too important for the Disney, so they agreed to purchase Pixar in uh, all stocks. The transactions worth $7.4 billion. The deal uh, netted jobs uh, $4.3 billion in Disney stocks and made him the company's biggest uh, single share uh, shareholder. In fact, uh, he made more money from uh, this deal than uh, he ever had from Apple. Speaking of Apple, after the registration uh, resi resignations of Steve, the company uh, crypted and went to their own lasting crisis. 
Apple uh, brought uh, multiple CEOs on the board, however, no one could get back Apple to its keeps and the company was left uh, with no other choice but it goes to Steve's backs uh, on the board. But it uh, wasn't easy since they forced him out uh, of the company in the first place. So Apple agreed to, to purchase uh, Nii XT for almost half of the billion dollars in the 1996 uh, and uh, appointed Jobs fears uh, as uh, uh, interim CEO and uh, as uh, the CEO on the top of that, Apple uh, guaranteed Steve's 1.5 million shares. However, he quickly sold them upon getting uh, his positions. Under Jobs' uh, leadership, the company introduced multiple revolutionary products, to, uh, and uh, the company uh, stock's price increased uh, from under a dollar. Uh, to almost $60 per share. And before he passed away, uh, his uh, net worth was around $10 billion, which mostly considers uh, of uh, Disney shares. Uh, it's uh, only after he died the company valuations uh, accelerated to over a trillion dollars. Uh, if Jobs has kept his 26% shares, it would uh, worth uh, hoping amount of $209 billion, even his 11% stakes that he held after the company went public would worth today over $88 billion, that would make him the third richest person in the world. Uh, nonetheless, uh, you can't really blame him for selling his shares, since he couldn't have um, expected uh, to be back at Apple after he was forced out. And that's why uh, the man who built the world's most valuable company never became the world's richest man. If you have enjoyed this video, give it the thumbs up and if you want the next uh, to appear on your homepage, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell uh, besides. Thank you for watching and I will catch you in the next one. Goodbye.